today's video I'm just gonna be talking about what I've been up to for the past two weeks. So like two weeks ago on when was it? The twentieth. Yeah, the 20th of July, I went to France, I went on a family trip, so I just wanted to like talk about that. So I went on a family trip to France and stayed, my, my, my mum's got uh, two of her cousins that live in France. They live in uh, a place called Creole, which is like an hour and a half away from Paris. So the last time I went to France was like when I was like really, really young, I was probably around like seven, eight years old. So I don't remember anything from that, well I do remember like tiny bits and pieces. I'm gonna remember things more now, now that I'm much older. It's gonna be easier to remember rather than when you're a kid, like, memories are just so vivid. So, just touched down in France, Charles de Gaulle. I'm on French grounds. My hair is a mess, wow. Now, I didn't really get up to too much over there. Like, I didn't do all like, the touristy stuff, like going to Paris and do, like, see all the museums and galleries. I did really want to do that. But my cousin over there isn't really into like museums and galleries and all that. And I wanted to do, I wanted to do that, but I don't know, it didn't end up happening. And I was going to buy the Paris Pass, and the Paris Pass was on sale. And I was going to buy that, um, but then the sale went, and the prices went back up to normal, and it was just ridiculously expensive. So didn't end up buying that. But I thought maybe I'll just go to a few of the places, like the galleries and stuff. But it didn't really end up happening. Um, which is a shame. We did go to Paris and see the Eiffel Tower and we took pictures. So yeah, we went to Paris and we saw the Eiffel Towers, the Eiffel Towers, the Eiffel Tower, there's only one. And yeah, we just took pictures, had a look around. We saw the, um, the hotel that Princess Diana stayed at. Uh, we took pictures there, that was on another day. Um, I really wanted to go to like Notre Dame and see the Louvre and all that kind of stuff, but we didn't really do that. Um, so the trip to where I stayed at in Creole to Paris is an hour and a half, so it was like a quite a long distance. I did go to Disneyland, which was exciting, like first time going to Disneyland. Look where I am guys, Disneyland Paris, first time, so excited. And it was so amazing, like it is actually like as magical as people say it is. And the rides there, oh my god, the rides. The rides there are so amazing, the roller coasters. They have indoor roller coasters, so they don't have like roller coasters outside. They have rides that are outside, but the roller coasters are like, I think they are all, yeah, pretty much all are indoor roller coasters, and they're probably like the sickest roller coasters I've ever been on. Like the lights and the, the graphics and everything that they have inside that when you're going through the roller coasters is just so amazing and it's like because you're in the dark and you've got all these lights and like kind of like laser lights and like starlights and they've got like kind of like graphic display screens and because you're in the dark everything's just like oh, wow it's like blows your mind and it's just, it looks so amazing like so sick i think it's a, well, isn't that aerosmith i think it's an aerosmith i don't know if that's the name i went that one the space mountain that one was good i really liked that i think that, that was like another roller coaster as well there was like there were so many rides but i went on all of them i went to both parks because i bought the tickets for um it was a one day two park ticket so you can like hop between parks which was good and i got to see the parade i wasn't too interested in the parade but the parade was happening and i was trying to get from one place to another where my cousin and my sister were in another part of the park on another ride and i was somewhere else and trying to like call each other to so I could find out where they were and the parade was going on and it was so hard to get through like all the crowd it was like the crowd there is just so big and like the whole street from the, like, the entrance of the park all the way down to the castle is just full of people just sitting on the side of the pavement waiting for the parade to happen it's so amazing and the weather was just amazing like hardly any cloud and it was 28 degrees and it was boiling like the weather was just perfect for Disneyland it was just so amazing so yeah the rides were amazing the parade was amazing I didn't see the whole parade but I just I did stand there for a while to you know experience that you have to experience the parade
like that's something you can't miss and then a few days later we went to a park which was like near the airport the airport was Charles de Gaulle and yeah there's a park called Asterix Park which is like another theme park that was like similar to Disneyland it's like being back at Disneyland <laughs> But like without the parade and all that but like the rides and like the buildings inside like the shops and everything it was sort of like Disneyland kind of cartoon character kind of theme Which was so amazing because like back at Disneyland again I thought it'd be like a normal like fun fair theme park like it was like similar to Disneyland and it was so nice and the roller coasters there were amazing as well oh and there was a dolphin show a live dolphin show which was just amazing like I didn't know there was gonna be a live dolphin show I've never seen dolphins before I didn't get to touch them but it was so amazing like seeing them perform and it was just so amazing they had like dolphins and then they had like two seals as well And it was like so magical. Another part of the park was like um, sort of like ma sort of like a magic show, but not a magic show. It was like for kids. It was it was all in French. They were talking in French, but I could still like enjoy it and get a good experience of it. And basically, there were like people like acting. It was sort of like theatre, but with to do with, like sort of like magic. Sort of uh, I don't know how to describe it. But it was like acting theatre, but with like magic, with like magic stuff. It was for kids though, but I still enjoyed it. It was still pretty good. We did have a picnic in the park with my whole family over there, and the ones that went, we had like a get together in the park, and we had like a barbecue, which was really nice. The weather was really good as well. And the French love their baguettes. They love their baguettes and the croissants because obviously they're French but they love the baguettes and they, the baguettes you go to the shop and they make them fresh like there and then so we just picked up some baguette and it's freshly made it's so hot French love their baguettes and their bread you can just go to the bakery and they make them fresh so like where I was whereas over here you go and then they're already made you just pick them from the shelf or stand or whatever and you just buy them wherever when you go there they you order it and then they make it fresh and you get them like hot and fresh and it's so good we went to a wedding as well it was my cousin's dad's cousin's something 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 like that and yeah we got invited as well to come along and yeah it was the mendy if you don't know that's like like a wedding ceremony which happens on a separate day to the wedding and then you have the wedding on another day and then another day you have the Valima which is like the after wedding celebration kind of thing so yeah we went to all three of those which was really nice he says I'm standing out but in a bad way my outfit's popping now it's a wedding and I was driving over there as well which was so cool at first it was so confusing 
like I used to like turn into rolls and then like stay on the left side when I was supposed to be on the right side so that was weird and the roundabouts as well going the other way around was just so tricky at first but then I got used to it and I got, I got so used to driving on the other side of the road so that was like a lot of fun as well driving over there it was like a cool experience they've got this like fast food restaurant called quick which is like similar similar to mcdonald's but they have mcdonald's over there but they have their own kind of mcdonald's sort of called quick but it tastes really really good it was really good we used to go there all the time it's like go in the car and just drive and we always did that just go together it was like great fun also i bought macarons as well like I have to like buy macarons but it's like a chocolate shop where they do like loads of different kinds of chocolate and biscuits and they do macarons as well so I bought a box of was it, a box of 12 for 14 euros and I haven't had them yet because I'm gonna do like a video of like trying the French macarons and I bought uh, different chocolates as well so I haven't had those either so I've still kept them and I'm gonna do a video of them of trying them but if you want to watch that video then don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you can stay tuned and you don't miss that video also if you enjoyed this don't forget to give it a thumbs up and yeah leave a comment down below if you've been to France and what you if you've been to Disneyland or what you thought of Disneyland but yeah that's it for today's video I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you in the next one